What is up guys, welcome back to SD Outdoors. It is Super Bowl Sunday. Um, by the time you guys watch this, it'll be it'll be afterwards, but it's Super Bowl morning. Um, got about three and a half hours to fish here. I figured I might as well get some in while I wait for uh, my plans later. Um, I'm gonna be fishing a creek that I've fished for about 10 years or so. It's one of my favorites, uh, not necessarily because of the numbers. You really don't get many numbers here. It's pressured pretty hard. Um, one of the more well-known creeks around, but I love coming here for the scenery. There's always fish here, so there's always a good chance to catch one. There's always a good chance to catch a big one, too. So that's what I'm hoping here. Uh, mostly brown trout in here. Um, I used to used to be able to catch native brooks and wild browns out of here, but like most streams, if you put brown trout in it, they start taking over. Um, unfortunately, that's kind of how it is. They're more aggressive than, than brooks, and they kind of push them out. I haven't caught a native brook here in about two or three years. I know they stock it with brook trout though, so it, there is a still a chance to catch one. They do stock rainbows in here as well. Used to be able to come here and catch all three species pretty easy, but last few times I think I've only caught browns, so we'll see. I'm um, going to be throwing a spinner around. It's really cold. It's about 28 degrees. I'm supposed to get some snow here soon. going to try to beat that, but anyways, uh, also could catch some pickerel out here too. I've done that before. It's been a few years, but I've seen some big ones. So, Let's see what we can do. I'll see you on the water. There we go. Why is my freaking drag so loose? Oh, it's a pickerel. Look at that. It's a freaking pickerel. Well, that's pretty cool, I guess. I don't get the chance to catch them very often. Alright, well, here we go. First fish of the day, it's a little pickerel. Um, Hopefully you guys can see it's snowing pretty good. I don't know how my lens is looking, um, but here we go. Get him back in. First picker in a while. Knew there was some in here. Off he goes. There we go. This might be the first trout of the day. It is. A little brownie. A little wild brown it looks like. Really just a just a few minutes after that after that pickerel. It's a slow start, but we're picking up here. I only have about an hour and a half left. So there you go. A little wild brown. First trout of the day. Get him back. There we go. What do we got here? Another little pickerel. Just a little guy. Wow. That was a little wild trout. Pickerel population is definitely here this year. All right. Well, sorry guys. You guys didn't, you guys didn't get to see that release. I was messing with them getting the hook out. Of course he inhaled all three trouble hooks and then and then he took off uh, he fell in the water took off so sorry about that but it was just a little pickerel uh, see if we can get at least one more before the day's over all right guys well that is going to do it for today obviously didn't miss the snow too 
too much, but uh, it was snowing in almost the entire time. So I apologize about any water drops that were on the uh, the lens there. Um, did my best to keep it clean, but it's it's pretty tough when it's coming down like this. Um, fishing wise, ended up with that one little brown and two pickerel. Um, first pickerel was okay size uh, for this creek, anyways. So can't really complain about that. I don't get to catch pickerel too often, so that was kind of cool. Um, a lot of trout that I saw today just would not commit. They would uh, they would chase the spinner in, or they would I'd see them whiff at it. Water's super clear, so I could see almost everything. I saw probably about a dozen trout almost bite my spinner, but. Hey, that's all right. It's a good day. Uh, now I'm going to get home, watch the Super Bowl. Let's go, Eagles. Thank you for watching SC Outdoors.